Good morning. I am Riji, Associate Professor, Department of ECE, Rogani College of Engineering and Technology. Today we are going to see about Unit 3 Link Design with and without Frequency Reuse. On completion of the students can understand the concept of Link Design with and without Frequency Reuse Satellite Communication. Link Design with and without Frequency Reuse. Intra-orbital link connect consecutive satellite on the same orbit. Inter-orbital link connect two satellite on the different orbit. Design of satellite system. Here we are having the satellite satellite repeater to transmitting antenna low noise block converter receive and demodulator decoding information output. The input information, then encoding, modulator, up converter, high power amplifier, we can transmit to the repeater, then receiver. So we will have a transmitting session and a receiving session. Classical satellite system. If you see the classical satellite system, it will have a mobile user link, inter-satellite link, gateway link, communication between the mobile user link to through gateway link to base station gateway. We will have ISDN and PSTN, Public Switch Telephone Network, User Data, GSM and the data can be communicated through the vehicle. So the classical satellite system is available in nowadays. Low noise block down converter, a device mounted in the dish designed to amplify the satellite signal and converted them from a high frequency to a low frequency. Low noise block converter can be controlled to receive signal with a different polarization. The television signal can be carried by a double shielded aerial cable to the satellite receiver while retaining their high quality. A universal LNB is a present standard version which can handle the entire frequency range 10.7 to 12.75 GHz and receive signal with both vertical and horizontal polarization. Demodulator, a satellite receiver circuit which extracts or demodulated the wanted signal from the received carrier. Decoder, a box which normally together with a weaving cord make it possible to encrypt encrypted transmission. If the transmission are digital, the decoder is usually integrated in the receiver. Recorded video information to be played during the television receiver tuned to very high frequency 3 or 4. Modulation, the process of manipulating the frequency or amplitude of a carrier in relation to an incoming video, voice or data signal. A device which modulates a carrier, modulator are found as a common in broadcasting transmitter and in satellite transmitter. Modulators can be used by CATV companies to produce a baseband video television signal on the desired VHF or UHF. Atmospheric losses. Losses occur in the earth atmosphere as a result of energy absorption by the atmospheric gases. The weather related losses are referred as atmospheric attenuation and the absorption losses by gases are called absorption. Atmospheric SCA indilation. This is a fading phenomenon, the fading period having several tens of seconds. It is caused by difference in the atmospheric refractive index, which in turn result in focusing and defocusing the radio wave which follow different ray path through the atmosphere. Fade margin in the link power budget calculation are called as atmospheric stillination. Link design with frequency reuse. Frequency reuse is employed to produce the cross polarization caused by ionosphere, ice crystal in the upper atmosphere and rain when the wave being transmitted from satellite to earth station. This is the horizontal polarization, vertical polarization, what we are using to control the uh, satellite. So based upon this we will have some quiz question in the C band and more especially KU band rainfall is more significant signal fading signal spreading attenuation and not the above. So the answer is a signal fading. So uh, second question the signal from satellite is normally aimed at a specific area called footprint. So from this we can easily identify the how the link can be uh, used as frequency reuse concepts thank you